All right, buddy. I think you can go. I'm gonna do a little video, Larry. Yeah, no problem. I'll do a stop and go. Go ahead, buddy. Go, 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 go. All right, guys. We're back at Bamboo Forest. Brother Larry's with us today. Say hi to the people, Larry. Hey, how you doing out there? <laughs> It's a good egg. We got a couple of people in here with us today, surprisingly. Um, the, you know, the parking lot is full. I don't know what the hell's going on. It only holds a couple of cars, but there's uh, two other cars there. So. Go, buddy, go. This is where one of the bamboos spots is over here on the left. Go ahead. Why are you uh, why are you protecting me like this? Staying very close. Before I couldn't get him. I couldn't get him to come near me. What? over here what's over here come on buddy we're gonna go check out the bamboo this is one of the easier ways in it's a lot of thorns but definitely a game trail it's been closed off, right, as you can see, pretty much ground level. Careful, buddy. Check that out. Wild, right? <laughs> How crazy is that? Wild. Is that where the hole was in there? Uh huh. Yeah, there's one. No, well, there's a couple. There's there's one right there. There's one right there, and then there's one on the back side. How deep it, I? Probably like a few feet. I don't, I don't think it go. It, I thought it might have went really deep, but it doesn't. Gunner, careful, buddy. It's interesting to watch him maneuver in here. It's a whole different, you know, a whole different element to watch, to watch the way he, he walks through. It's crazy, huh? There's multiple ones now. When we first came in, that was the only one that was here, and now down the other side, there's more. But we gotta kinda come out. You see how they're, they're starting to build one right here? Huh? You see all this crisscrossing stuff now? Yeah. The big X right here. There's a lot, if you really look at it. It's not, it's by design. That big X with the bend coming into it. There's a lot going on here. A lot, right above, I didn't even notice this, right above my head.
This is one of my favorites. That one's not connected. And it actually. Huh? Gotta take some strength to snap. Really? A lot, bro? Yeah. Look at that one. That one's actually laid in there, right? Actually, there's a stick laid on it too now. But look at that one's laid in there, and then it's broken up here. Wow. It's snapped to come back down. That one's broke at the base to go up and bend and tuck under another one. It's not like somebody's coming in here and just doing this shit. Coming in with, like, tools. Because you, know, you would need some kind of... You know, I think about this shit. You would need some special tools in order to do this. It looks like hardly anybody even comes in here. No, it's, and nobody knows it's here. You saw you saw how it looks when you come in, right? Yeah. It looks like a driveway. Yeah. It looks like a rich person's driveway. Look at these, Larry. Two of them. Wow. You can't even say it's like an accident. It's two of them. I mean, look how these are huge. Yeah, they are. That's my favorite. That's like two and a half inches round. That's Massive. Two and a half yeah. inches. Massive. You see that one, how it's bent? Yep. It's crazy. I love this shit. Beautiful. It is. It really is. Beautiful. It really is beautiful. I totally agree. I really totally agree. It's like, oh, it's such, a, it's like art. It's, it's, it's like mathematic genius and artistic and like symmetrical brilliance. If I could... If I could, yeah, you'd have to be like stealth because uh, because of the houses on the outskirts. You know, you couldn't like light a fire. You wouldn't be able to like be loud or not. You know what I mean? You'd really, you'd really have to be quiet. Why they put all of them in a bundle like that, man? That's a whole bundle. Yeah, it's a, it's like a fort if you look at it. He's talking about that, I think. There's a whole lot of them stacked, and there's it actually goes in a semicircle. Well, a square, but like a U-shape. There's some on every side. Let's go hear what he thinks about it. Hey, Dave, all right, you coming? Come on, up and over, up and over. Boom, good boy. Your obstacle course training. I never, when we did service dog training and they did the obstacle courses, I never, uh, I never knew when he was gonna need it, but. Here it is. You gonna go? You gonna go help Larry? Wow, they actually it used to be different. Bro, look at this. It snapped here. Yep. Holy Another shit! Another one snapped here too. Maybe I just maybe I just don't remember it properly, but it's always possible. My memory ain't what it used to be in a lot of ways. That's why it don't hurt to video everything. Like this. Huh? That piece of free is just hanging there. Right. There's a lot of that going on, I agree. There's uh this is what he's talking about. There's just there's like trees laid in there and vines that cross over, like that's just laid in there. That piece of tree. It's interesting how they use trees like as part of it. It's actually a beautiful thing. It really is. Yeah, you know, it's, if I, if, up, oh, yeah, we, uh, we have it in our, in our neighbor's backyard, he has a huge pond, right, and, uh, he's got a huge pond with a lot of stuff in it, like turtles and whatever, all sorts of shit, it's a huge pond though, it's got an electric fence around it, because, like, the animals come to eat his koi fish and his turtles and his, so whatever, um, but he has bamboo also around it. And that bamboo is probably from like here to that tree, maybe even further. And it starts to grow under, like on the ground, it grows sideways and all sorts of shit. And then it grows up and under our fence. It's blown the fence, like it's, 
it's found like holes in the fence and went through it wow. grows sideways up down around it grows all these crazy different ways it naturally grows straight up but if it has to that's deer is it yeah it it could be rabbit but that's a lot so it's probably a small deer that piebald deer is in here the piebald yeah, it's uh see this see this is interesting. That could be a that could be a deer. Wow. But if it is, it's a large deer. Wow. So that looks like a deer. You see how it looks like a knuckle? <clears throat> it looks like two knuckles. Mm -hmm. So that's a deer. So chances are that's deer scat. It's wow. just a big boy. I wouldn't even have seen that. Or it's just healthy eating. You got good eyes. Uh, yeah, yeah, kinda soaking everything. Yeah you do. It's that hypervigilance. So down there, there's more TPs and stuff, but like we'll we'll go check out some other stuff if you want. All right. We're gonna have to find a good way out of here. All right, friends, I'm gonna stop this and then we'll go again late in a little bit. I see something out that way. I don't know if I can pinpoint it though. What are you trying to zoom on it, huh? Yeah, I don't know where. I'm trying to figure out where it is exactly. Let's see that, then that. It's right in there. There it is. Wow. Right in there. You see my thumb? Nope. Yep. Oh, that's what I'm looking at or trying to look at. It's hard to get on it, you see, because all the shit in the way. Yep. Definitely looking like something. It's hard to say. Uh, the visuals have like taken a nosedive. Yeah. You know, close ups anyway. I don't really know what to chalk that up to, but. How far how far away is Bob is from here? It's far? No. Close to you, huh? Uh, this is easy to talk about. It's like a half hour. Oh, wait, wait. No. Hang on, let me pause this. Yeah, this is the over. Like, this is one of the high points uh -huh. that overlooks. So you got the one bam you got the one bamboo spot on that side. I don't know why it keeps it keeps pausing and and then the other one is far on that side of the forest. Yeah. So if you want we can go that way. I think the most people that went in are gonna be coming out now. Oh. You know what I mean? Because we went and hung out over there for a while. So anybody who went in should be on their on their way back. Yes, I love it. Yeah, on the North Shore, wait, oh, we can go up there. Wait till you see the view. If we go up on that hill, you'll love it. You can oversee the, uh, you can see the Long Island Sound perfect. Yeah, that's a talking tribe spot is about 10 minutes from here. It's all connected, you know, in some way or another. It's all connected. Oh yeah. Well, it's not you know it's it's not the same like we were talking about earlier. It's it's not like you know it's not the same for them. We've been dumbed down so many different ways. Yeah. I mean, look at I don't know. You get my drift. So many different things we can tackle. You know, in the Colosseum in the, in Rome, right? Yep. They used to they used to do the gladiator stuff in there, right? But they also used to do something where they would flood it. They would flood the whole Colosseum, and uh, they would put ships in there, and they would have like you know wars, like ship wars in there, and uh, and then they would take the water back out nobody architects today don't even know how to do that they, they don't even know how to do that shit today they could put ice over it but that's about it I know it's amazing man how could they do it like what 2,000 years ago yeah, this is the one I was showing I always show on looks a lot bigger in person man
All this shit, yeah, it's just so much. So much. It, what's the point, you know? There's gotta be some kind of energy source, huh? I'm thinking. It's usually what it is. So when they, when they stand alone like that, I don't really know why. You know, I don't know why they do it all the time. This guy's having a field day. He's picking up every scent under the under the sun. What do you got? What do you got? Go find piebald. What did we? What didn't I forget? Was somebody named her? Snowflake maybe? Because it was it was blizzarding. A pie baby maybe somebody said. I think R G came up with a good name. There's a glass. I don't remember seeing that. Want me to take it out of here? No, no, it's all right. The glass is fine. Yeah. Like plastics and papers, I take. They use that. They use that stuff. Oh yeah, right there. Yeah, I've never seen anything like this on Long Island. This is crazy. Yeah, wait, do you do you don't throw the North Shore that much? No. Yeah, I got. I'll show you some amazing spots, bro. I grew up on the South Shore. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I only do. I don't do much there, but but it's not that it's bad. It's just different. Yeah. There's a lot of hills over here. Yes. Yeah, I'll show you some of the other uh, Indian preserves and shit. It's all right. It's all right. I've left a lot out here recently. You got your necklace in the mail, right? Yeah, I did, man. All yeah, right. Thank you for it. Yeah, thank right. you, man. I was just telling, I was curious because I know I got a. Uh, I was. A, I was asking somebody yesterday and they never answered me. This is pretty, this happened a few days ago. I just thought it was interesting that, first off, that it fell where it fell, you know, in between. Yep. But then also it, it fell and it touched right into the next one. Yep. You know what I'm saying? And then that too, those fell back there. It fell into the next one. I highly doubt it's accidental. Oh, matter of fact, holy shit, that's still, it didn't fall into the next one, that's still part of it. Yep. Wow, it's, that's part of it, and it breaks off and goes that way. Well, that's pretty badass. It's even cooler. Yeah, I'm going to be doing some camping if you're interested. Sure, man. Uh, okay, good. Yeah, so, like, you know, kind of... Kind of the more the merrier without being too many people, you know, like three, three or four would be, you know, my max. I'm a, Where you looking to do it? Multiple spots. Many, many. I got a few picked out. But, um, you know, Brian's going to do it, I think, too. Montauk is strange. Yeah. That's the other bamboo spot up there. You see it on the other side of the hill? Yep. Bamboo. Let's see. If, yeah, wait till you see that forest. That's a, that's like you go walk straight through it easy. There's a trail carved out. That's why. Hey. Yeah, the energy's cool in there. You will like it. All right, friends. We'll be back. Oh, see. Sorry. I wanted to show you from the top of the hill, but you could see out on the sound. Oh, I see it. Pretty, right? Yep. That's wow. Connecticut on the back side, way out there. Nice. Yeah, watch the zoom on this thing now. It's great. And then it does, that's times 20. Wow. If I do photos, it does times 100. Wow. It's insane. It's insane. Only go to eight, right? Eight times on mine. I know, but this—that's why I got this. And when I do, it, everything blurry, man. That's why I got this, cause it's like it's a game changer. What's it, an iPhone? No, no, no. Fuck that. Android? Yeah. Wow. Samsung Ultra, 23 Ultra. 
Look at the cameras. One, two, three. See them? Wow. Five of them. Probably expensive, that phone. Yeah, it's not fucking... Yeah. Huh. Yes, yeah, very. I have an old... I have an S10, man. I, you guys... Like, I, I would never in my mind in my life spend this money on anything but i use it so much yep. that it's like stupid for me to keep getting something that's not you know what i mean you never use them other things right that these people use no what are they called gopros and shit GoPros. no somebody gave me a couple like and uh i have them and like i i, I use them for some shit but it, the sd cards fill up so fast uh -huh. and then you got you gotta like take it off and download it yeah, and do a bunch of shit with a laptop it's so much money and so much effort. Yeah. That guy from Swan Lake, the guy in Canada, Rob, right, Rob it? He, yeah. He, he does that. Yes. He has a backhand now. He, he has some good material, that guy. Yeah. I like that guy. Yeah, he's got a lot, he's got a respect for them. I don't, I don't use the backhand. Like, everyone always tells me to, but I don't, I don't do it. <laughs> he seems like a really cool person, the guy, too. He, he, oh, he loves them. He, he respects them. Yeah, he does. That's all you need, man. That's really all you need. Oh, he's definitely respectful to them. They love that guy, probably. Mm -hmm. You know? Just like they love you. He's got a relationship. That's all. Yeah. Like, if you follow, if you do what he does to a T, you'll, anybody, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It. He's a he's a blueprint for what you got to do. Wow. Just like Mike Patterson, just like what we do here. You know what I mean? It's, <clears throat> it's not as hard as everyone makes it out to be. That encounter was cool. <coughs> I heard that encounter once before on Patterson's channel the other day. That guy from Louisiana. Oh yeah, yeah, he's a good egg. That that encounter definitely happened to that guy too. Red Creek Mafia. <laughs> what was he? The Louisiana guy that it happened to? Uh, yeah. He was in a tree stand, thirty feet up. He said. I don't know if that is. Yeah, either Louisiana or like somewhere over there. He was in. He was in by by, by Luxy. <laughs> A Luxie or something where it happened to him. That must have been crazy, man. He said the thing was like 800 pounds, man. He thought the thing was gonna kill him. <laughs> that must have been a crazy bad feeling for that guy that day. It's yeah. I mean, he he's learned a lot since then. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Just like I have. Like I I reacted the way I reacted when I first met Bubba. Yep. Was not how I would react now. Yes. It's different. There's a, you're, you see a monster. That's what you think you see. Yeah. So it's this is why I make it my mission to change perceptions if if possible. Mm -hmm. Because there's Not so many people making them out to be a monster just because of the way they look. But you know. I don't know. You get my drift. I do. They, they put their spiritual beings in, not monsters. Yeah. Even there's a movie called, uh, like, Bigfoot, Littlefoot or some shit. And uh, when the guy, when the Bigfoot, is, to the Yeti is talking to the guy, the human, he's talking in words, right? And, like, they then they flip the perception to the to the human, and he's all he hears is, rawr, 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 you know, like him screaming and, you know, you know, scaring them. So it's it's like that's like that's a cool little scene. My son watches a movie all the time called Bigfoot Family. It's a cartoon. Oh. It's awesome. That's a nice house over there. I think that. Wow. Yeah, it is. It is one house. I think. It's a beautiful looking house. Yeah. Right on the edge. I'd love to be in one of those. The house, there's another one on the on this side that's huge. It's like an old, it's a beautiful old style. This is like a new style, you know, like modern. Yep. The one on that side is like that, like carriage house style. That's got to be expensive in this area, that house right there. Well, what, the one that we're going to see on this side is the one that, the driveway we came up. Okay. So, yeah, they, uh, I'm sure they're pissed this place exists. Well, the county owns it. There's nothing they can do about it. Nope. I wonder if a person ever owned this land at one time. I don't think so. I don't think they would have gave it up. I know I wouldn't have. No way, this is a lot of land here. Good boy. You're so good, Gunner. I forgot you were here. Such a good dog.
bamboo has been measured growing more than 47 inches in a 24 hour period. Badass, huh? Yeah. Bamboo absorbs carbon dioxide and releases 30% of oxygen into the atmosphere compared to an equivalent mass of trees. Two types of bamboo, running and clumping. The runners can stretch over a large area landscape. The clumpers grow more slowly. The bulb shaped rhizomes, underground stems on clumping varieties are short and new shoots called culms come up closer to the parent. The long, far-ranging rhizomes or running bamboo can extend for some distance and are joined with knolls, which a comb. You hear that? Yeah. Fifteen hundred species of bamboo that can be found in Asia, Australia, North and South America, and Sub-Saharan Africa. Bamboo can grow on different altitudes and under various climate conditions. Wow. All right, that's enough. It's amazing. Oh, shit. It's so thick in here. For the most part. You got this upside down tree. This huge thing here. Look, looks like a barbarian club for a giant. Alright, like. This one is actually broke up there and it comes down. Actually, there's a really nice vibe in here. It's amazing, every time we come in here, every time I come in here, the, the dog starts barking. Look at these, bro. Look at these here, look at like, look at that one. See how it's spun and it comes backwards? Yep. You know what I mean? Wow. It's like broke and then it comes this way and then... These are all new. This is coming across. A lot of new stuff. Every time I come here, something new. And granted, some of it, I'm sure, it was right in front of my face and I just missed it, but, I mean, there is a lot of new stuff going on here. Look at it, more and more and more is going. Pew, 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 pew. More and more. Gunner! There's a good boy, hi. Boom, boom, boom. Did you have fun with Larry? Watch your step in here. There's a lot of these bulbs down here. Yep. Feel them. They're like, it feels like they're like metal, bro. Wow. Like, seriously. It feels like metal. It's insane how strong they are. That's the roots, huh? So strong. Yeah, they can't look. That's why somebody cut them there. Somebody cut them there because they can't get the roots out. You know what I mean? Yep. Wow, look at that. See, like those, like that, that bend right there, like that's not, so, that, those aren't like naturally, you know? Yeah. I mean, Sasquatch are natural. I hate when I say that, but you know what I mean. There's no other explanation in my mind. This place is wild. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh?
lot of scrapes here. A lot of scrapes here. I'd imagine these these bucks probably come in here and really, uh, you know, get a good get a good scrape on these. I haven't really seen many bucks in here, but we'll have to we'll have to see. We'll have to see what happens. Uh, you know, as their sheds start coming back. I know. Did you hear that puppy? Yep. Yeah, well, that's how you are. You're such a Long Islander. I was just going to say the same shit. You feel that breeze, right? Yeah. That, that off the ocean breeze just says, just tells you rain's coming. You could smell it. I could be anywhere, bro, and that breeze comes in like like everybody around me will be like, oh, here comes the rain. Like it's, <laughs> it's wild. There's a seagull. It's a little nest back there. We'll go check that out one day. I think we tried to get back there once upon a time and it was hard, but it looks like there's looks like there's quite a bit of an opening for me. Dryad vibes over there, all those vines. Let's see if I can get a better look. Yeah, that should do it. Knocker? Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> You're like an animal planet pro. <laughs> Good boy, what are you doing? Yeah, that was a good tree you picked. What you gonna? Who's that? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? <laughs> Some bamboo over here. I wanna get I wanna get a good couple of shoots in uh, one day and see what I can make out of it. Maybe make some walking sticks. Yeah. Looks like some really strong stuff. Good boy. Kind of, uh, All the way yeah, kind of, yes. There's a few of them. There's a few that cut off in the middle, and then there's one that goes around the outskirts. They closed, the people who live out there closed it off with a bunch of brush. Yep. Look, right there is the only way you can go in and out. I've tried, bro. I've tried to go in and out other ways and it just sucks. That's all private land over there, right? Yes. Yeah, everything, yeah. Everything off this trail is private. What? What? This is living a piece in harmony right here. What do you hear? I hear a little knocking in there. It's just a tree creaking, maybe? That's where that tree snap happened to me when I was here in the blizzard. Came from in here. All these birds showed up all of a sudden. And look, there's another bamboo shoot laid in there. Wow. They laid that there. So I'd imagine. I mean, I don't. It had to be a human or, or them, you know what I mean? It's possible that like people like grab a piece and they, they you know, they're like, oh, I want to keep a piece. And then they carry it a little ways and throw it. But 
I mean, how many times could that be the case, though? Because it's everywhere. It's, like, scattered all over. This is where the deer usually are in here. Oh, shit. Oh, I gotta show you something. Still filming or no? I'm gonna turn it off right now. <laughs> 